tap the precision mode icon and let's choose the line tool. You can move with one or two fingers and even stretch and rotate the guide if these are on in your heads up display. Switching to eraser turns your precision guide pink and with other brushes it's gray. The line precision tool is infinite by default. I like to use this when I don't exactly know how big my sketch is yet. Press and hold down on the measurement to input a specific length. By double tapping the middle of the line tool, it contracts to the length of your handles. Turning precision mode off hides your measurements. Now for the angle precision tool. You can move the guide with one or two fingers. Press and hold down on measurement to type in a specific angle in mind. You can also use the eraser with the angle shape guide. It turns pink when you do so. I find the angle tool useful for quick pattern making or for architectural drafts. Double tapping the middle of the shape guide turns into a crisp 90 degree angle. Turning precision mode off hides your measurements. 